Welcome to Manage Engine. In this video, we are going to explore predefined reports within Endpoint Central. To access predefined reports, click on Threats and Patches, and then Reports, and then select Predefined Reports. Let's start by discussing patch reports. In this, we have Applicable Patches Report, which displays patches ready to be deployed in your network. You can filter data according to various criteria to see patches applicable to your systems based on these filtered criteria. Supported Patches Report details all patches supported by Endpoint Central, available from vendor websites, whether or not they affect your network. This is particularly useful when planning to upgrade or apply new system updates. Missing Patches Awaiting approval lists missing patches requiring your approval before deployment can proceed. Remote Office Patch Summary offers an overview of systems at remote offices, displaying their vulnerability status and patch deployment details. Patch Compliance Report provides a patch level deployment summary, along with compliance status based on customizable compliance settings. This percentage is based on the missing patches in a system which will increase as you install the patches in that particular system. Undermark patches as compliant if they achieve option, you can mark the minimum threshold percentage of compliance for marking that system as compliant. Moving on to system reports, these provide a holistic summary of managed systems in the enterprise. System health report displays the health status of systems along with missing OS and third-party patches. Systems requiring reboot lists. Systems needing a reboot to complete patch installation. System compliance report shows the compliance status of all systems within the enterprise. This compliance percentage is based on the number of patches installed in that system out of the total number of patches supported in that system. Even here, you can customize the minimum compliance percentage for that system to be marked as compliant. There's also an option to mark unscanned systems as compliant too. Remote Office Compliance summarizes compliance status for systems at remote office locations managed by the enterprise. Next up for automate patch deployment reports. In this, we have systems with APD tasks, which displays information on systems with active automate patch deployment tasks. Systems without APD tasks will show systems missing APD tasks facilitating targeted deployments. Lastly, we have self-service portal reports. Under this, we have patches yet to be installed, which will list patches available in the self-service portal pending installation by users. Patch deployment list reports configurations for patches published to the SSP. Detailed view provides comprehensive details on patches published to the SSP. Thanks for watching.